iconic LA taco truck. We are in taco heaven. We're in taco town. Mi nombre es Miguel Martinez. Vamos acá la Venice y la Brea. La troca se llama Tacos Leo. Bien, la carne como se va dando vueltas así, se va cocinando, se va cocinando y ya cuando esté cocinado ya, ya uno lo puede. Oh. What is good, people? Today's episode. Hold on. Hey, what is good, people? In today's episode, we're gonna be reviewing Leo's taco truck featured on BuzzFeed. Is it worth it? And their forty-seven dollar taco, the one dollar taco. Apparently, Leo's taco truck is known to be one of the best taco trucks in LA. On BuzzFeed, they say that the tacos each cost a dollar twenty-five, and it's the best bang for your buck for the flavor and just the quality of taco. Out of interest, I'm actually gonna be flying out to California anyway, so we're gonna go ahead and check it out. And then I'm gonna share with you guys my review of Leo's taco truck with some of my friends. Stay tuned, hope you guys enjoy. Peace. Good people, we're about to hit up Leo's taco truck. We're in the gas station right now. We've got to take a piss first, but um, apparently, Leo's taco truck is famous, you know, featured on BuzzFeed. Great tacos, taco truck at a gas station. You know, you couldn't ask for anything more, but yeah, stay tuned, y'all. Ten out of ten. You think so? Yes, sir. What do you think, bro? Hopefully, it's better than El Cordo. Tacos are hey, better. Huh? Where are we at, though, again? We're in LA. Tacos. Oh, is it Leo's? Leo's, Leo's taco, taco truck. truck. Buzzfeed certified. Buzz, Buzzfeed. How videos. did you find out about Leo's taco truck? Uh, it was Buzzfeed. Buzzfeed. <laughs> Buzzfeed. Oh, okay. What they say about it, though? They say it's the uh, best tacos you're gonna get for a dollar fifty. So. Oh, okay. First, all right. So what do you do, man? You gotta put the onions and the cilantro on the tacos. Yup. And then a little bit of lime. I'ma go no salsa first. No hot sauce. Pure tacos. Right, go, go on that one. Right
Rafael. Definitely worth more than $1.50. <laughs> oh, yeah. Yeah, dude. I got the Al Pastor. Hold on, hold on. Let me get a camera frame on dude. Okay, okay. Oh, boy. Boy, you oh, boy. Need some of that lime juice in there. Take it, bro. Take it. Right, let's see. Let's see if it lives up to hype. Raw flavor. Out of 10, what do you think, bro? Honest rating. Give it a 7. Still out of 10. Is it dry? A little drier. Dude, the taste is kind of addictive. Really? It's kind of fatty. It's good. It looks good, man. All right, y'all, you'll see what it hey, hold is. Hold on, hold on, hey, It's already recording. Oh, okay. All right, y'all, you already see what it is, man. We got some three alpha store tacos and some mangoes. Keep it. We're gonna sauce it up. Is this spicy? No. A little bit. Okay. Just a little bit. I'm gonna drench it a little bit, you know? Give it a little swirl. We're gonna go in on the alpha store tacos. Good. How much was it? 150. How would you rate it? I think for what it costs, it's really good. A lot of flavor. Make sure you guys put in your onion, cilantro, drench it in the sauce. Make sure you guys eat it hot too. Don't let it sit out in the cold for too long. Right? Oh yeah. And they got sauce, onion stationed up and they wrap it up for you. Pick it up, ready to go. Mm. No. The cabeza is definitely more moist. The carne inside of taco is a little dry, but this one's definitely a lot of fat in it. Go in, baby. Oh yeah. Oh sexy. What's your favorite taco joint out in the city, bro? I'm gonna have to go with the uh, Taco Del Gordo. <laughs> really? Yeah. Really? Taco Del Gordo? Yeah. Taco Del Gordo, when I went, dude, like, I ate 20 of them by myself. Life changer. Life changer. No joke. The Dio's taco truck isn't the same, bro. They were fresh, definitely. But I think these are kind of old. All right, well, we got 10 fresh ones coming out, right? Yeah, we'll see. All right, let's get it. Let's get it. Let's get it. Let's, 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 let's get it. So apparently there's a taco truck right across from Dio's taco truck. Let's peep this. Look how many people are out there. Yeah. Yo! These are fresh, yo. Yo, these are straight off the grill. Yeah. Let's go, put them down. Yo, let's go, let's go. Hurry up, rip those open, bro. Rip those open, bro. <laughs> yeah, buddy. Yeah, buddy. Hurry up, hurry up. The wind chill's too much. Tacos del Gordo is a little better though. It's a, <laughs> Savage. It's a, it's a sauce. It's a they sauce? don't have the sauce game down. Oh, really? 
Alright, uh, let's go in on this fresh Alpha store straight off the. What do you call those, dude? The spinners? I have no idea. Yeah, I just taste the burnt like taste for some reason. Do you guys get that? I just taste burnt like burnt. They try to get the char, they did it wrong. Tacos El Gordo or Leo's? No. All I taste is this, bro. It's a burnt. So, what do you think? Should we trust BuzzFeed? <laughs> Not BuzzFeed. What is that one? Right. Cabeza. Cabeza. La cabeza. One last bite for the boys, you know? Hey bro, go in. Guys, we just finished eating at Leo's taco truck. Um, this is gonna be an unbiased review. We're gonna be rating things out of five and also why. Come on, you wanna go first? I'll give it a 3.5. I gave it 3.5. Out of five? Yeah, out of five. How much was it per taco? Per taco was 150. Quality was mediocre, so that's why I'm gonna give it a 3.5, but because of the pricing, that's why I got it. Yeah, you justify it because of the yeah. price, bro. How about you, bro? Three out of five. How come? How come? That's a savage rating, bro. What? What did you give him? I didn't five. Three point five? Yeah. What's three point five? <laughs> three? What's, what's the difference? Oh, wait, why? 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 Honestly, um, kind of disappointed. It wasn't as good as I expected. <laughs> but when it was fresh, it was pretty good. And um, the salad bar setup was really nice. They okay, wrap they up little onions and little what's the names, radishes, whatever. Okay. Little plastic bags and you can take them, you know, that's okay. pretty nice. Okay. Yeah, yo. <clears throat> Honestly, I think that's what made it, uh, gave us high expectation, that little ro rotating thing. The gyro thing, dude. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, dude, I looked at that. I thought it was going to be a five out of five, but, you know, it is what it is. Um, tacos. I found better tacos at Los Tacos from New York and also Taco Del Gordo from San Diego. Yes, sir. I agree. But for 150, yeah, it's a good bang for your buck. So if you're around the city in LA, where are we? Brea? Brea. Yeah, if we're in Brea, then Brea, Los Angeles, then this might be the spot for you to hit up for some cheap grub. But other than that, I'll give it a 3.5 out of 5 also. Yeah. Yeah, man. If you're, you know, struggling university student, if you are struggling to pay rent, yeah, this is the spot. Yeah. If you're a homeless man and you got some extra pocket change, you know, if you got ten dollars, you can, you can get you, you know, a nice taco for sixteen bucks. Ten doc, ten. Uh, wait. Yeah. yeah. All right, guys. Thanks for tuning in. Thanks for tuning into the channel. You already know what it is. You know, like, comment, subscribe. You know, you want to end off the video? Say what's up, man. What's up, goodbye, YouTube? Everybody. Bye. Work hard, everybody. Wow, inspirational.